Chenault. Rebounded by Bahannon and ripped away by Mutal Yaru for the bucket. Now they got to keep. This Louisville team plays a lot of zone, but they'll match out of it. They go to man at the end of the clock. Oh, another good look there. Russ Smith, first team all Big East. Oh. Underneath for Jang, who tried to the Big East champion in the uh, NCAA tournament, rather, with their win in the Big East championship over St. John's last night. 20 wins now, 10 league wins. That's usually a double that guarantees you a spot in the NCAA field. You know, nice rotation defensively. What a scramble by Villanova. And Yaru wound up with it. Nice having the big guy in the back, too, to assist. And it made it very difficult for Hilliard to get it in bounds. Then Jang sent it off the leg of Yaru. And Jay Wright's team has been the turnovers. They have the worst assist to turnover ratio in the Big East. You know, 15 a game. That gets you in a lot of trouble. And one last night. Despite 17 turnovers against the Red Storm, 66-53, the final for Villanova last night. Russ Smith, leading scorer for. Never happened to that force out. Yeah, they got rid of that years and years ago. Nice up fans. By Jang. He'll be an important player tonight to deal with that Louisville pressure. Kid is quick. Black Sheep. Foul third on the team. He's trying to guard Peyton Siva. And that three rattles out. Siva's had a. Siva using a Jang screen. Jang from the free throw line. A little bit long. Record 128, but. He missed seven games this year with a broken wrist, and I think the rest of the Big East has become more aware that Jang is going to block your shot. He couldn't score. The tip wouldn't go either. They're evenly matched. You got to get odd matches. And he had to take that. You rule. <laughs> oh, Jefu's arm. Look at that. A turnover waiting to happen, it seems. Yeah, the other way. Pinkston right down the lane, dumps it off. Yaru scores. Pinkston didn't want to get it swatted. By Perhaps if they took over that eight minute stretch. Look at the come from behind again. You got to have eyes behind your head. 13 player who led them to the championship. Just a warrior out there. He was on the all tournament team here two years ago. Jang missed a little turn to jump hook, and it's a lot of frustration in the blue uniforms right now. And then walk. Smith traveled. Look at this pass. Yep. They got away with it. They sure did. They were very fortunate that they did. Yaru off the setup from Pinkston. Well, that one those towels. He said, go to St. Luke's <laughs> Hospital and get some treatment. Well, Jay was funny. We talked about during that workout today in the ballroom, a couple of the players kept dropping the towels, which didn't. Uh, and out. still much confidence in this country from Africa for a chance to play college basketball. Boy, have they both taken advantage of it. Jang, nicely done. The heated exchanges in languages and the refs would know. Mm -hmm. There's woofing going on or not. Haunting. Well, that, that was a good shot he just missed, but Louisville's yeah. offense throughout the course of this game has not been good at all. They should have been way up at halftime. And if you're relying on ooh, hold the team to 24 points. Wow, great effort by Yaru after he threw a bad pass. He barely do. Archie Diakono off the bell, missed the three. Nice. Yaru on the offensive glass. Nice, nice rebound. Tip to himself. Good gather. Smith left alone at the. Duke got this big guy back and he scores 36 points, you know, so <laughs> they can win. And. Even Carolina started playing at the end of the season. You know, they're a sort of a sleeper team that might. Oh, then we'll know. All I know is I think you could come on, and, on ESPN and break it down for us on Selection Sunday. Well, I don't know about that, but <laughs> I, I love basketball and I like what we're seeing. Pinkston seems to do that a lot. You know, he gets to the rim and then the shot's kind of jammed underneath the rim. Hillier to miss. He worked hard to keep it alive for Yaru. He threw it at the feet of Chenault. General. Activity. Chanel underneath for Yaru, altered by Jang. Yaru got it back, so an extended possession for Villanova against this swarming defense. Look at the help. 
Archie Diacono still has not scored tonight. I'd be really tired of seeing Montrez Harrell in my face. <laughs> Switch to a 6'10 guy. Bob to Bahannon, and he got shoved. But did a great job of concentrating through that contact as he was releasing the ball. He does have a nice looking stroke, too, doesn't he? Now the bucket, a chance for three for Muftal Yaru. It takes a toll on your defense. Mm. It's so hard to keep guarding. Even Van Trees trapped that rebounding activity. Yeah, Rue on Van Trees. Foul on a reach in by. He did well to get it back to Siva. Smart play. How often do guys try and dunk that when they don't have a chance? Exactly. Or make his, here's that little brush screen lob. Good read. One bad lob doesn't steps there. Maybe they just rattle you. Yeah, Rue to the bucket. It went around the rim and out. Well, Joe Lenardi, as we mentioned, oh, Julie, do a great job running people off. Kingston underneath for Yaru, Harold there, and Van Trees.